For the sake of transparency, I sold. Wait, this line sounds familiar because recently Chicken Genius also sold his Tesla stock and he said the exact same line, copycat me. So yeah, I'm making this video to share with you my confession that I actually sold away my Coolie Cashy options position. Well, not all of them, but some of them. In this video, I'm going to share with you exactly why I did what I did and my exact game plan forward to brace myself against the volatility. So if you want to learn how to use options to accelerate your return, then and keep on watching. Hi, Minasan or Kylie, Chloe here, and welcome back to my channel, the only one place for you to learn about stocks, investing, as well as options. If it's the first time you're coming to my channel, remember to hit the subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you will not miss out my future investment insights. An early thumbs up is also appreciated because it will tell YouTube algorithm that you find this video helpful and it gets to help to push up to more people to inspire them to start investing safely. With the recent market climbing all the way to all time high, you may be wondering, hmm, is this a good time for you to take some profits off the table? Or you may be thinking, should you hold on even longer to make even more return in the future? Well, this is the dilemma that every single investor face, including me. And that is why in this video, I want to share with you my exact thought process so that I can guide you better to become a better investor. Previously in this video, I talked about how you can use Coolie Kaishi option strategy to turn a $5,000 portfolio into more than a million dollars in about 10 years time. So in this video, I'm going to update about my option positions on the trades that I executed. So if you have not checked out the previous video right here, make sure you do check it out right now before you come back for this video for more insights. If you have been following me and my Kuli Kaishi option strategy since May this year, you will have realized that your portfolio has increased tremendously when you take action accordingly. In fact, some of the trades have increased by 100% in the past few months using the power of Kuli Kaishi option strategy. And previously, I also mentioned that the principle about Kuli Kaishi strategy is really simple all we need to do is to hold on to this contract for one year and rinse and repeat this strategy regardless of the market condition. But for the sake of transparency, I sold at least some of my options positions. And the reason why am I doing this is because the following two reasons. Reason number one, time decay of my options contract. When it comes to options investing, I always tell my students that they need to remember this very important element called time decay, which means that your option contract value will definitely decrease over time as it approaches nearer and nearer to the expiration date. Unlike stock, you have infinite holding power. When it comes to options, you are really limited by time. And that is why I decided to close one of my option position on SPY as it has a shorter duration to expiration date. However, do note that when I'm talking about shorter expiration date, it doesn't mean that I am buying a few months call option contract. This is an absolutely no, no. You can see that the contract I closed on S&P 500 expires on 16 June 2023, which actually still gives me more than 500 days to the expiry date. When I first initiated Kuli Kaishi strategy on this SPY contract, that was back in 20th September 2021. And back then, I invested about $4,500 to buy this option contract. And when I closed it off last month, 28th of October, I managed to take back $5,570. If you think about it, that that's 22% return in just one month. However, if you look closely, you will realize that if I chose not to close earlier, my profits would have been even more right now. I could potentially make back $6,200 over dollars, which is equivalent to 37% ROI. But the thing is, nobody can ever predict the market. And I have to confess, back then when I initiated this trade, I was feeling so sleepy, I was lying on my bed, and I end up choosing the short expiration date instead of the longest expiration date. That is why I just want to make sure I rectify my mistakes as soon as possible. And the moral of the story is don't invest when you are feeling sleepy. <laughs> By the way, if you still don't have a brokerage platform to invest in options, then I would highly recommend Mumu, an international brokerage platform that allows you to buy stocks as well as invest in options. Mumu is backed by Tencent and it's regulated by the Singapore government. And the beautiful thing about Mumu is, 
from account opening all the way to funding your account takes only less than three days and right now if you deposit more than 2700 singapore dollars which is about 2000 usd or equivalent you will even get a free apple share on top of that if you sign up mumu through my link below i will even give you my own most updated private portfolio watch list basically inside the watch list i share with you what i buy why I buy, what is the price I'm going to buy, as well as what are the option strategies that I am going to execute. If you want to get your free Apple shares, as well as my own private portfolio watch list, make sure you open your Moomoo brokerage from my link below. After that, submit your Moomoo ID to the Google form so that I can send you my watch list to your inbox in the next one week. Now, back to my portfolio update. You will realize that Kuli Kaishi strategy is famous for executing on this ETF called QQQ. And in fact, I also sold two of my QQQ positions away. I initiated these two option contract back in May this year and I just closed it a few days ago giving me close to a hundred percent return. And the reason why I'm closing off my option contract is because the market has really reached to an all-time high. The truth is my mentor Pete always tell me there is no harm taking profits and that is why I just want to make sure I take back my profits before waiting for the next opportunity to come. However, do note that I have not closed off all of my options position through Kulikashi strategy because I truly believe that the simplicity of this strategy will make me even more money in the long run. That is why I will always leave two core positions intact and ride with the market as it continues to go up. Of course, some of you may be wondering, well, the market can also come down then what will happen to your two positions? Well, I don't really care because at the end of the day, the philosophy of Kuli Kashi strategy is to really rinse and repeat and trust the process because the market goes up 90% of the time. So right now, after taking some good profits, I now have more cash. What I need to do next is to wait for the market to pull back to a decent level such as 20 EMA, 50 EMA, or even 200 EMA before I initiate even more positions through Kuli Kashi strategy. In my opinion, options is really such a powerful vehicle that will allow you to make consistent income regardless of the market condition. So if you are completely new and you want to see how you can tap into the power of options to accelerate your return then do join me in my upcoming free options foundation class where i'll be sharing with you three powerful option strategies for you to make income when the market go up go sideways and even go down all you need to do is to click on the link below and register for your spot and if you like this video remember to give it a thumbs up and share this with your friends so that more people can be inspired to start investing safely also remember to follow my telegram channel because i constantly update all my investment insights over there as well with that happy investing and i will see you next week Mada you. bye bye thank you guys arigatou gozaimasu